So, welcome to Johnny Grass's Stuff and Things. We have one hell of a thunderstorm coming. But what we're talking about today is I have a flat tire on my tractor. Yeah, tractor. <laughs> Alright, so this is what I did to jack it up. Just take a 2x4, it's easy enough. You ain't got to get fancy putting all the 2x4 block it off. Blah, blah, blah. Then you got a flat tire. So, you instead of buying a tire and trying to get it on the rim spend the extra damn ten dollars and buy one that's already on the rim it's that much easier it comes with all this stuff right here and these are your parts that make it work and i have learned through my youtube videos because i use my phone it comes with two different check that out two different spacers and that'll make a difference on your axle right there but we got the inside that goes in uh, outside and these one of these two go inside so all right what you got to do is get yourself a pair of pliers there is a cotter key right here and none of these are bent over but i've already bent them out because i have to make these videos as fast as my as i can cotter key comes right out do not lose this thing happens all the time washer the tire comes off all right there we go now we go with our spacer i don't know which one of these is the right insert might as well grab the tire while we're at it so first your spacer and that goes on i'm pretty sure it's a smaller insert on this one and always remember to put this thing on the outside God forbid you get chair on the wrong way. Normally you would grease these things right away, but that's what that tube is right there. That is a grease fitting. They go together easier. They're already greased. Now we put this on. Well, look how much room we got on that spacer. And it's not enough. It would be too short, so I bought these zinc coated washers. Put one on the inside, one on the outside. They don't fit. Okay, you got to drill them out or find a bigger one. However, there is the right, right washer right there that it came with. Let me put this on first. All right, and then you got a lot of slack in your hole right there. And what I'm going to do is put one of these on next. And then you go back with the pin that you ain't supposed to lose. It goes right in here. But I mean, you could literally use it like that. But it wanders. You can't drive a straight line. It would work like that. And then you want to bend these out. Take your pliers and bend them like this. One way, one the other way, but I'm gonna take that back off, throw these out, and get it right. Y'all have fun. That's what Gracie does stuff and things, lawnmowers, thunderstorm, little bluebird houses. Can you see my bluebird house over there? I don't know. Can you see it? Yay! There's a bluebird house, and right there's my bluebird. Y'all have fun. I'm running hard today, but yeah, that's how you change a tire on a lawnmower. Don't go and buy just a tire. 10 extra bucks, I'm telling you. Is that much easier? God love you. God bless you. Grass, you got stuff and things to do. It was a beautiful day. Bye.